Good morning, everyone. How are you all? I hope everyone are safe and healthy at home. Do you all know me? I am Shodhavani, faculty of Buddha Shining Stars, teacher for the last seven. Today, I am going to teach you two new letters. They are letter M and letter V. Yes, now we are learning letter M and letter V. Before that, children, let us recall the previous class, what should I have learned? Do you remember what are learned in your previous class? Yes, you have learned slanting lines and patterns. There are two types of slanting lines and two types of patterns. Right slanting line and left slanting line. Up and down pattern and down and down pattern. Related to these patterns, you have learned two letters. Do you know what letters you have learned? Can you tell me what letter you have learned? Yes, you have learned letter A and letter L. Yes, children, you have learned letter A and letter L. Do you know the sound of letter A? What is the sound of letter A? Letter A sounds A. Yes, letter A sounds A. A for Apple. A for arrow. A for alligator. Yes. Now, what is the letter? What is the sound of letter N? The sound of letter N is N. The sound of letter N says N. N for net. N for nest. N for net polish. Yes. There are a few more pictures related to letter A and letter N. Yes, children. Now, we have finished with recap of previous class. Now, let us start two new letters as I told you before. Letter L and letter V. Yes, children. Now, we will start with letter M. How to trace letter M? First, standing line, left standing line, Right slanting line again standing line makes letter M. What is the sound of letter M? Letter M sounds M. Mm. Letter M sounds M. Mm. M for monkey. M for mango. Yes, children. Letter M sounds M. Mm. M for monkey. M for mango. M for move. M for map. There are few more pictures related to letter M. How to trace letter L in the A? Are you ready to trace with me? Yes. Point your two fingers together and start tracing. First, standing line and left slanting line, right slanting line and again standing line. Are you ready to trace with me now? Yes. Standing line, left slanting line, right slanting line, and again standing line, which is how we have to trace letter M. Now I am going to show you how to write letter M on the four line concept. As you all know, four line consists of top right line, first blue line, second blue line, and bottom right line. Now I am going to show you how to write. First we have to start from top red line. We have to start from top red line. The second blue line standing line. And we have to write left start from standing line from top red line. The second blue line connected to the standing line. We have to join these points children. We should not forget to join these points. And again we have to draw right standing line from top red line to Second blue line and again standing line from first blue line to second blue line. This is how we have to write letter M. Now I am going to show you again. Standing line, left slanting line, right slanting line and again standing line. This is how letter M we have to write on the four line. You should not supposed to write like this, below the line or below the line or not catching the point is also, point is also wrong. Is it wrong? Always you have to write it in a proper way. And 
the help of dots, it will be easy for you to place lecture with any children. Now, you all, oh, I hope you all clear with lecture M. I will repeat again. What is the sound of lecture M? Lecture M sounds M. M says mango. M says monkey. M says moo. M says map. So, now, what is the auto right lecture M? We have to start from top red line to second blue line, standing line. Again, top red line to second blue line, left standing line. Again, top red line to second blue line, right standing line. And again, top red line to second blue line, standing line. This is how we have to write lecture M. I hope you are clear with lecture M. Now, we are going to lecture B. Now, we are learning letter V. How to trace letter V? Yeah, I am going to show you how to trace letter V. First we have to trace left slanting line and again right slanting line connected with these two points. Yes, right left slanting line and right slanting line makes letter V. What is the sound of letter V? Letter V sounds V. Letter V sounds V. We say we for violin. We for was. We for van. We for vegetables. There are few more pictures related to letter B. I repeat again. What is the sound of letter B? B says w. B says w. W for was. V for vegetables, V for violin, V for wham. Yes, children. How to trace letter V in the A? Yes. Point your two fingers together and look at me how to trace letter V. First, we have to trace left slanting line and again right slanting line. This is how we have to trace letter V in the A. Are you all ready? Yes. First, left slanting line and again right slanting line. This is how we have to trace letter V in the A. Now, I am going to show you how to write letter V on the four line points there. Yes. How to write letter V? Always remember children, we have to start from top red line to second blue line. Yes. We have to start Top red line to second blue line, left slanting line. We have to start left slanting line and again right slanting line connecting to this left slanting line. This is how letter V will be written again. We have to write first left slanting line and again right slanting line. This is how letter V. Children should not suppose to write like this and without connecting to the point. This is, you can make a gap here, right? This is wrong. Always you have to join the points here. Now, as I told you to keep a dot with the help of your mom and place it on the dot to help you to write letter M. This is how the letter B is. Now, tell me what is the sound of letter B? Letter B sounds W. B for Y. B for vegetables, B for violin, B for, tell me this, what is the what is the picture for letter B? Was. Yes. I hope you all learned letter M 